Bonjour, bonjour everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Cyril and my dog is Guabao. So I have been a stem cell researcher for quite some time and this is why I can tell you about the science that is behind skincare. So if you don't want to miss any of my new video, please subscribe to my channel and don't forget to ring the bell to not miss any of my new videos. And for today's video, I'm going to talk about a subject that I probably should have talked about a long time ago, which is body care. So for this video, I'm going to tell you what are what I call the fundamental for the body care. And they are actually the same as for the face. The only thing is that for the body, I do find that it is uh, always better to find, I would say, a more practical uh, product because personally, I don't want to spend like one hour in my bathroom to just take care of my body. But theoretically, you can use all the active uh, from your face on your body. So the first step is of course to have a proper cleansing routine. So for the body, um, I always recommend as for the face to use an acidic water-based cleanser. So please stay away from soap. Soap is dreadful. If you do want to use soap at home, use it only to clean your dirty linen, but don't use it uh, for your hand or for your body. So I have a few body cleansers that I like to recommend. So Overall, in general, I am less strict about the formula for my body than for my face for a couple of reasons. First of all, is because I do like to have fragrance in my body care because it does add to uh, the pleasure. Obviously, it would be better to completely avoid them. So if you have super sensitive skin, if you have um, eczema, if you have also children that has a lot of eczema, just stay away from any uh, perfume. This is, this is not my case, so I would say that I'm willing to take the risk. So I tend to rotate them also because uh, I tend to get bored by my uh, body cleanser. So among the one that I love, uh, I love the one from Eucerin, the PH5, which is the old shower cleanser. This one is fantastic. So hence the name, it has an acidic pH. It is extremely gentle. It doesn't strip the skin at all, but also it is it does lather and it's very nice when you use it um, on your body. So I don't currently have it um, in my home. Another product that is a bit similar, it's from the French brand SVR and they call it a uh, cleansing oil. So this is the lipid restoring cleansing oil anti itching, which is also excellent. Even though it is named a cleansing oil, this is not properly an oil. Uh, it does has uh, perfume, but the list of ingredients is very minimum. It is also very pleasant to use. And if you are in France, you can buy like uh, a lot of it. So this is one uh, liter. So you do have a lot for a very affordable price. This one is also excellent. And it also can double up as a face uh, cleanser because it is so gentle. Another one that I love is from a very old French brand, which is uh, Roger Cavaillès. This is the peach milk bath and shower gel. So again, a formula that is uh, pretty simple. I've already talked about on my channel. So the surfactant is magnesium laureth sulfate and coca medropropyl betaine. And then you have um, glycerin. There's also free fatty acid. So it is very gentle. At the same time, the smell is divine. It also lather a little bit, but at the same time, it is not going to dry out your skin. The other type of body cleanser that I love are cleansing bars that are not soap. So among the few that I love, I love the one from Avin, which is the gold cream, the ultra rich cleansing bar in the range of gold cream. This one also is excellent and it does have a perfume. I also love the one from Adama. I'm going to link all, all the products in the description down uh, below. What I love about them is that they are very convenient for the body and also uh, to use on your face, especially when you are on your go. And actually some of them are also use them instead of a shampoo and they are excellent. So you can check my video about it that I'm also going to link down below and over there on the top. Another one that I cannot really find in France, but I, I did find it in the United States. It's from Olay. This is this one. This is the Shea Butter one. So it does also have fragrance, but this one also is divine to use because the lather is very creamy, but at the same time, it is super gentle and it doesn't strip your skin. So if you don't have any major uh, skin problem on your body, you can definitely use a fragrance body wash. Just make sure that it has an acidic pH and it is not stripping. So the second fundamental that we all need to have, like for our face, is to have a proper exfoliating routine. So 
to exfoliate your body will make your skin first of all much more smoother and it also will help tremendously to your moisturizer to penetrate deeper and also to I would say moisturize the healthy layer of dead skin and overall you will see that your skin looks much more healthier you will have a, a glow to your body so my favorite method for the body is for sure to use a scrub and a pretty strong one the main difference between the face and the body is that the stratum corneum aka the skin barrier or the dead skin layer is much more thicker and resistant and therefore a scrub is perfectly suitable for the body. So the one that I've been using for years and years because it is very affordable, very efficient, it's the very infamous scent of the apricot scrub. So a funny story about this one is that I didn't know in the beginning that it was for the face because like I said, most of the time when I buy a product, I only read the formula and a little bit of the claims, but that's um, it. And according to this, and also how I feel about the product, I decide how I am going to use it. And this one, it is so strong that from scratch, I say, oh, this is a perfect body scrum, but also because of the quantity, because at that time, uh, the first time that I discovered it was um, when I was in the United States and in France, we don't have, a package like this only for the face because it is uh, far too big we have like tiny package so the first time that i saw it i said oh this is a body scrub but actually it is for the face so obviously i do not recommend to you this one for the face it is far too harsh and far too strong but for the body it is an excellent one that i've been using for years and years and it's also very affordable also on the side note i am not a big fan of those uh, sugar or salt base scrub that contain a high amount of oils and the reason is because they make the shower or the bath tub very slippery which I really dislike and then you need to clean the oil on the surface of the bath tub. I mean it, I find them a mess and also with the water the sugar or the salt really dissolve super fast which I also dislike. Okay so the last part is of course moisturizer. And you need also for your body, like for your face, to moisturize a lot. And the first thing that you absolutely need to do, and I always encounter this problem with uh, my clients in Paris when I do consulting, and also with my friends that tend to tell me, oh, I have always a super dry skin on my legs or on my elbow, I don't know what to do, and I'm using a body moisturizer. And each time I ask them, but do you use your moisturizer every time that you take a shower? And guess what, they told me, no. So every time that you're putting water on your body and it is exactly the same for your hands, you do need to apply immediately your moisturizer or else your skin will be dry. So I have a few of body moisturizer that I love. I tend to rotate them and I always have like I would say two categories of body moisturizer. So the first one are the ones that are always very emollient but they do have fragrance because I like to eat them because they smell good. They have a wonderful uh, texture and they are also excellent moisturizer but they have those fragrance uh, components so they are not I would say optimal so they are there also for my own uh, pleasure like I said I am less strict for my body and the second category is super modern super rich uh, body care products that are super safe so without any uh, perfume and irritant components so from far my favorite pleasant moisturizer are from the body shop the reasons because every time the formula is really well done i'm only talking about the party butter so they contain shea butter they contain also uh, cocoa butter this is uh, in general the base of the emollients that you will find so for the price you really have like i would say a great value so really excellent ingredients and at the same time you have the pleasure with a nice texture but my favorite body butter from the body shop is this one this is the hawaiian kukui cream i i mean this name is a, a mess to pronounce i'm again going to link it down below i also love the olive uh, butter but the smell of this one is simply divine also the texture is excellent and what i also love about it is that the smell is not too strong it does not linger for too much time on the body but at the same time it is a uh, super moisturizing uh, be careful in the body shop i only recommend the body butter most of the time the lotion are just not moisturizing enough and they also have a new category of product which is 
body yogurt or something like that that has a high content of ethanol so stay away from those but the body butter are excellent so now in terms of more dermatological i would say body moisturizer um, they are all from french brands so the first one is this one from svr this is the intensive balm this is the lipid restoring anti-irritation care severe dryness and itching and this one is probably one of the best body moisturizer that i know of the reason is because in addition of containing um, excellent emollients that are really going to replenish your skin in good lipids and also in excellent humectants, it has 4% of niacinamide. And this is one of the few body products that I know that first of all contain niacinamide, which is an excellent skin supportive ingredient, and also that has the proper concentration to really uh, works. And this one in addition also have uh, omega-3, omega-6, and also um, omega-9. So this one is excellent. It is also fragrance-free, completely irritant-free. Uh, if you buy it in France, it is very inexpensive. So if you happen to travel in France, I do recommend that you stock on this one. It is one of the best body moisturizer that I know. Also, if you have a family with children, this one is wonderful for this. And you can also use it on the face. Another one also that I love is a recent launch from the French brand Aderma. This is the Emollient Balm Anti-Scratching. This one also has a wonderful formula. It is extremely emollient and rich. It contains free fatty acid and also an extract from oats. So all Arderma is based on this ingredient. So again, and it also has niacinamide. So again, if you are prone to eczema, to very severe dryness, this one is excellent. And it is also one of the best in the market that I know of and again like for the SVR it is pretty inexpensive if you buy it in France in the other country I do not know. Something that is also interesting in this one is that it is uh, completely fragrance free and irritant free. So I'm going to link down below all the product that I've just talked about so I hope you like this video you can comment down below and tell me if you would like to see more videos on uh, body routines because I do have uh, a lot of tricks also for the body so if you like this video please thumbs up Subscribe to my channel and don't forget to ring the bell to not miss any of my new videos. You can also follow me on Instagram, I am Siri Laurent, I have a lot of content over there. And I do tend to simplify my content, I would say, on Instagram and be a little bit less uh, scientific and go, I would say, straight to the point when I do a small review. So go and check my account. And thank you so, so much for watching me. I will see you next time with my beautiful baby dog. So have a good day, everyone, or a good evening, and I will see you next time. Au revoir, bye-bye.